Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to my channel if it's your first time. Kinnan Tabi Singh Matole and I hope you will become a part of this family by clicking the resubscribe button down below. It is completely free. You do not have to pay a subscription fee or anything like that. So go go on ahead and click the resubscribe button. So anyways, um, welcome to a new vlog. Before we get into it, I did want to come on here just to quickly say thank you so much for the love and the support on my previous video. All your comments were so positive and encouraging. I read all of them and literally each one that I read, I got so emotional and I'm so, so grateful for you guys. And I think um, yeah, like I could feel the love. I could feel the love and I think that's what I was coming from in my previous video when I was talking about, you know, commenting in the videos and engaging is that sometimes it's nice to know what people are thinking. Um, imagine like you're standing in front of 40,000 people, you're giving a speech and only like 100 people are engaging with you. Sometimes it's nice to know what most of the people are thinking in the room. You know, are you making sense with what you're talking about? Are they engaged? Are they still enjoying? Are they still with you? So yeah, that's where I was coming from. But I really, really do appreciate the love and the support in that video, you guys. I did not realize how much love you guys have for me and this channel. It truly means so much. And I think that sometimes when you get used to doing something, you know, um, I'm used to vlogging and it's part of my job and it's something that I have to do I get to do um, is that you forget that there is a community of people on the other side that are rooting for you and are supporting you um, so it really means a lot and I appreciate it but anyways I just wanted to come on here and assure you because you guys were so stressed when I said I want to be more vulnerable and tell you guys about myself you guys were so stressed oh my gosh first of all I think I wanted to say that and assure you I will never ever ever do something that is out of character you guys I will never ever ever do something that I'm not comfortable with even if you paid me i would never do that everything that i mentioned um in my last video are things that i wanted to do and it was not because of a comment that i received that comment only i guess pushed me into saying you know what actually let me implement but yeah it was not necessarily that oh now i must change who i am just to please people or to get more views no it's nothing like that so i want to show you that everything that i'm going to talk about on my channel things i think that i had actually already started talking about in any event you guys will remember that i shared a bit about um how i used to struggle with confidence in high school and you know that journey i shared about me leaving corporate so just personal stories and experiences that i've been through and how i've dealt with them and how i'm dealing with them it's things like that i am not gonna come here and tell you guys my family secrets or how we made it through the month without money and how we had to go to bomakelo i need to borrow sugar <laughs> I am not gonna do that you guys um i know that once you get to that level of being transparent then your endeavors end up on gossip channels and people start gossiping about you that is not who i am so i will not be doing that um we are a drama free channel i'm all about just sharing experiences just to show people that we go through things we are human and just to encourage each other in how to deal with like challenges so it's things like that and some of the some of these things you guys also put in the comment section as suggestions you know like um how i navigated corporate i mean i did speak about in the past about um my journey a little bit in corporate and my me struggling with confidence and all of that but i never went into too much detail and these are things that you guys would like to know some of you guys would like to know and things that i would like to share as well and my, my experiences as a mom without a helper like things like that i think i once did a video when we turned one and i shared how it was um like raising a child without a helper for like 12 months you know things like that um that people can relate to and people can see that you also go through things and um so yeah it's not going to be anything that is going to be too personal you guys and i'm a very private person i respect my husband as well because we do i do share a life with him and everything that happens to me uh, well, maybe not everything, but yeah, most of the things that happen to me affect him as well and the rest of our family. So I would never come on here and do anything that would like um, 
disrespect him like that so you guys do not have to worry about me everything that i will be sharing is well thought of and calculated and i think i even remember a comment saying somebody stop and tabby saying guys <laughs> somebody speak to her she's lost her mind but yeah you can relax these are just going to be general conversations that i want you guys to um just to get that side of me and we have conversations about those experiences so i hope that it clarifies um it, it clarifies that um but yeah i'm really excited and i hope you guys are going to enjoy this vlog this vlog i heard you guys no changes in my vlogs i must keep the consistency so i got you i got you rest assured we are here to stay in fact i do remember the last time that i got a i received a comment someone told me that my voice is annoying this was like early early in my youtube days i had just started my channel and someone said like sent me a comment to say your voice is so annoying da, 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 and it hurts me so much but i never stopped and look where we are now so i know that you know um that was just the devil trying to like play tricks um but i know that there is bigger and better definitely i'm not doing this gummy steaky i am where i need to be i'm where i'm supposed to be and we are doing this so i hope you guys will enjoy this vlog thank you so much again for all the love i love you guys right back and i really appreciate you guys so enjoy this vlog and remember to give it a big thumbs up comment down below and subscribe to my channel if you haven't and yeah i hope that you will enjoy it one thing about me, I will wear a bucket hat. I love me a good bucket hat. And ever since I found these from h and i I'm obsessed. I also got myself these studs from Clix. These are by Studix. And I just wanted to have earrings that I can have on like all the time. Anyways, guys, I am off to China Mall. I need to go find a rug for Rui. Like, it's serious. I need to find a rug for Rui because it's getting colder now and I just want to cover and fill up that space. And I know that it's going to make a huge difference even visually, you know, from a deco and warm and cozy perspective. Her room is going to be much more warm, warmer now. Um, so yeah, that's where I'm going. I'm going to leave her behind because I give her to now. I think it's Hannah Mall. Her dad is also not coming with, um, so yeah, but Lusala, then I'm going to get going. So I think I'm going to take you guys with me. I did forget to update you guys in the previous vlog because I didn't mention that I wanted to, I was busy looking for a rug for her. But yeah, I ended up going to Chinatown here in Midrand and I found one, but it was in a bigger size so and also it was gray but again i also feel like i am warming up to getting a gray one as well actually so yeah um let's go to china mall i haven't been in so long i am so excited to go back there because i used to frequent there so much when i was finishing this house so yeah i can't wait to go there um yeah i hope you guys are good let's go to china mall Watching videos of us. I have been trying to get better. You said this gray one, you don't have. Um, that gray. Yeah. No, we don't have 120 by 180. We don't have one there. Long time is finished. That one. We use only one price. And if it's too big, I can return it, ne? No problem. You can come. For a smaller one? Yes. Maybe. If you can, maybe I'll check for that one without tassels. Maybe. I'll do check by the stock. No, that stock is out of the stock. I don't think that's maybe tricky. We can get uh, without the tassels, but we're going to try to check also. Okay. Yes. It's fine. Right. Thank you. Found a rug, you guys. I was gonna take a size 120 by 180 or something like that. And this is. Mm -hmm. 
this is 180 by 270 I think but yeah I'm so glad that I took a bigger size it makes much more sense it makes more sense really love it um, it's very nice and cozy and I think she's also going to love it because she loves playing in her bedroom that's why some of her toys are in here and I've actually just thought of something brilliant which I don't know why I haven't thought of it but it is that she keeps some of her toys um, in the toy storage box under the bed it's actually gonna make this room look much more neater when she's not playing with her toys so that's what that's what we're gonna do because there is space like this space there can you guys see but i'll show you guys handle the room um in the morning because it's quite dark now it is quite dark so you guys won't be able to see properly so i think i'll show you guys the room but this rug has made quite a huge difference and i love it good morning um, today is Monday and I am off to do my hair. I am finally getting my relaxer. Um, I'm very excited. Like I've been looking forward to this day because I told you guys my hair is like, it's a mess. I don't know if I should grab a coat because it feels like it's cold. But yeah, let's go to the salon to do my hair. See you guys, bless you. I'll see you Sorry. guys. Uh, I'm not late. I'll see you guys later. I'll catch up later. <laughs> Selling fan, blowing cold breeze on your body I can't tell you really what it is, but you got it Make up in the morning, you got dresses in your closet But you grab them tight, you in love with being modest You a mood, body giving sin of views I'm just saying I'm amused But you ain't even flexing Ain't you cool, tag it up, cover walls Different vibe and new improves But you ain't even flexing And you ain't gotta try too hard Number one fan inside your blood Tell me think about inside the walls Words cut deep, it's like a swan Making me better, you hotter than pepper mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You with a big step on chasing a cheddar mm -hmm, mm -hmm. My hair is so long, it makes me so happy Uhu Dilashem before I forget, I wanted to show you um, Leroy's new rug because I did say I'll show it to you guys during the day so you can see properly. So, this is what it looks like. I did try to put it horizontally like this way and it didn't work. Um, so, yeah, this is how we've put it for now and we might change it i don't know or just change the layout in Dura's bedroom i don't know because also um we did get a new chest of drawers um because we need like a chest of drawers for this space so i'm getting that made so we're gonna get a new chest of drawers and then still need to decide what's gonna happen with this i might just sell it but i will let you guys know um but yeah we're getting a new chest of drawers so i'm still yet to decide where that that's gonna go whether it's gonna be here or there and if we're gonna move her bed to face maybe this way i don't know we'll see yeah we'll see but this is the rug nonetheless i'll put a screenshot of the store name on here i'll just write it down here so you guys um can visit if you are interested in buying a rug last week you guys last week was the first week 
ever in my influencing career that I posted a sponsored post every single day of the week. That was so crazy. Every day, guys. Every day. I get post that. It didn't make a sponsored post. I'm so grateful though. I'm not complaining at all. So, Mudimu Omusa Omohao. This is from Superbalist. It's my order that I got. And I wanted to show you because I want us to look good. Really babot. Really babot. So, I fell for the trend, you guys. I fell for the trend. But also, I don't fall for trends that I don't see going beyond just the trend. I am a loafer girl. These are loafers, right? Yes. I am a loafer girl, so... Yeah, these are loafers. I am a loafer girl, so I had to. I had to buy these. Although, I'm not sure because I did see another pair from Shein. But also, I think it's a little bit in South Africa. But I did see another pair from Shein that is thinner. It doesn't have a big sole like this one. I wanna say it's very ganda ganda. Like it's very ganda ganda. It looks like a ganda ganda kapo e nyatila madimo ni type of shoe. Whereas the ones I saw from Superbalist are more not Superbalist from Shein. They're more like flat and minimal, and they were. I'll put up a price. They are by this brand from Superbalist. So I bought these man and I bought these by Superbalist these kitten heels how gorgeous are these guys these are very stunning so I've had these in my cart for a while now and I eventually bought them sorry guys <laughs> I eventually bought them Kibona Vadienza sale. So they went on sale and that was my sign to check out my cut. So I bought these. I think these are really nice. What do you guys think? I think these are really nice. Very grown up and very elegant. I love them. Also guys, the thing about petite girls that I've learned is um is it's better to buy a shoe especially if you're short now if you're petite and short it's better to buy a shoe that is pointed as opposed to round in the front so a pointed shoe will give you an illusion yeah you have longer legs whereas a rounded shoe makes your your leg look short and if you're short then it doesn't um flatter it's not as flattering but i do not think that is entirely like the rule because i do find that with some round shoes i still look decent although i will admit that pointed heels do make me feel different and they do make me look different but it does not mean that the rounded ones let's on them like the gap all together i don't think so i don't think so but i do get where they're going with this analogy and then i've been wanting to buy a coat so i bought one why is this size 34 and it does look small oh it looks beautiful so i've been wanting to buy a black coat i don't have a black coat and i feel like a black coat is a staple yeah a winter closet it looks very nice oh it looks very nice this is um from h&m but i bought it online because i don't think they have this in store but i'm happy with this i think it was 8.99 and it's so worth it because i know that it's going to last me forever and ever oh the fit ah. Ah. it's perfect it is perfect it is perfect oh, guys it's giving rich mom ah guys <laughs> it's giving rich housewives of midrand Huh? Yo, it's definitely giving rich housewives of midrand and I love it. I I love it. I am obsessed. I'm obsessed. Oh, the cut is absolutely stunning. I really love it. This is how it looks at the back. It's quite long. 
Let me see if I can get on this chair and show you how long it is. So that's how long it is. But I don't mind it. I like it like this. Absolutely obsessed. Today's Wednesday and I have a couple of errands to run. I need to go out to China Mall. I want to go exchange the rug I got in Leroux's room. I'm also making a couple of changes in Leroux's bedroom as well. I actually sold her bed yesterday. But by the time you guys watched this, I'm, I'm sure it would have been bought, hopefully. Because there are people that showed interest but yeah so I, sh I sold her bedroom because we are getting um bunk beds in her bedroom i bought them from mr price i ordered from mr price they should be getting delivered soon i'm crossing fingers and then so that's why i'm also rushing to get the new rug so that when the bed gets here then everything is in order makes sense and yeah i'm happy with it so yeah i'm gonna go do that and then later we'll come back and just catch up again with whatever the day has in store for us but i'm excited to be vlogging again did you guys miss me because i missed you so much my word is born we don't spit no So they're checking for me at I, I don't know if they're checking at another shop or where but they're checking for me if they have the gray in the size that i want i don't know if i showed you guys the gray one that i wanted but he's busy on the phone now with somebody checking and i'm really crossing fingers for um for him to come back and say that he's got because the one that i was gonna take in the size that i wanted has tassels and i don't like them like I don't like the tassels. Let me show you guys. I don't like this. I don't think it's nice for a kid's bedroom as well. It's giving old school, so I'm just hoping for the best. My anxiety is shooting up now because um I'm looking at the time and I haven't showered. I'm not done packing. I'm almost done though. I'm about 90% done with packing and I need to sort out Leroy's bedroom. As you guys might have seen. Hi guys. Where my man is. Hi guys. So today is a Monday and I am traveling to Durban with Domestos. I'm so excited to be traveling with Domestos or to be working with Domestos again this year. So we are traveling to KZN for training there. And of course, I will be taking you guys along with me. Um, so yeah, there, was quite, there were quite a lot of things happening today, this morning. And the first thing is, no, it's not a lot of things, Kimaka. It's just... <laughs> It's just Luro's bed that was coming in, so we're done with that. I just want to sweep and then kick in matrasi and just sort it out before I leave. Um, so yeah, I wanted to show it to you guys. I'm so excited. She's gonna be so excited, like she's been wanting a bunk bed, and we finally got it for her. Um, so let me close here. So this is her bunk bed and it's from Mr. Price Home. Um, I thought that these stairs were on the other side, not by the window. It's very awkward because of the way the bedroom is set up. So we might have to move her head that side. We might have to move her head this side and Reto Sekamona by the window. But yeah, anyways, let me sweep up quickly and just sort of set it up. Luckily, we went to get a mattress that we can do. So we do have a mattress for it. So I'm just going to quickly set it up and go shower. I wanted to install a wig. I don't know if I'll still have time for that because I need to leave the house latest one o'clock. Um, yeah, latest one, one o'clock. Our flight is at 3 p.m. So I need to be at the airport by that time.
guys this is it i did a rush job as you guys saw especially with the the bed katlasi but yeah i just wanted to give you guys an idea this is the bed it's from mr price home like i mentioned i forgot to tell you guys that i eventually went uh with a gray rag because they didn't have the beige in a size that i wanted and this gray works so well because it's bright and it just opens up the room well and i also love the size i think the size works so much better than the one i got it was taking up too much space in the room so this one works much better um yeah so this is the bed let me know what you guys think lira is gonna be so excited it's unfortunate i won't see her reaction because i will not be here when she comes back but yeah this is her bed or her bedroom and what it's currently looking like I love it. Okay, so it seems like we're still good on time. Um, it's half past 12. I should be leaving latest 1 p.m. So, yeah, at least that I managed to lay down my wig but i'm gonna hide it with a cap because or hide this band i'm gonna wear a cap because um it is heel a little bit so yeah i don't think that it's gonna look nice so i was thinking cap like a piece i wanted to also show you guys my face look at this this stuff is just not going away. I am honestly over it. I am over it. I think this is much better. So this is going to be my airport fit. I'm wearing a black trick suit. And then I just need to go over my outfit for tomorrow again i'm not 100 percent confident with it the um, day tomorrow is just going to be training so i need to wear something that is going to be comfortable and i wanted like loose fitted jeans so that i'm not suffocating in jeans but i don't know which ones so yeah that's my dilemma right now or maybe i should pack um because i also wanted to wear my trench coat I, I wanted to wear this trench coat tomorrow or today so I actually feel like it's it works with my outfit do you guys remember it? this is from pick and pay clothing I showed it to you guys a few months back or a few vlogs back it's from pick and pay clothing um, yeah I think it works with today's outfit then for tomorrow, yeah, I need to figure out what to put together tomorrow. So let me do that, guys, and then we're gonna get going. I wanna do it all with you by my side. If you're in need, me here tonight. Be brave and come along. I'll be your right. Promise we don't need no big lights. We can travel the world, so just say yes. Choose to do whatever comes next. We made it. We made it. Uh, yes, it's here. It's here. Oh. It's here. Sorry, it's here. Oh, it's here. Oh, yes. I, I, was, I was holding <laughs> your camera and I put it in your bed. Oh, oh yes, you okay, did. Okay, yeah, okay. it's here. It's here. It's here. We can relax. Guys, no soul. No soul. No soul. <laughs> we good. We good. <laughs> Okay. We are here guys. Are we 
here at this place. Yes. This is from here. Fine eyes. Fine eyes. Oh, we had fine eyes, guys. Here's the hotel. That's where we'll be staying. So you got And here's everywhere. How are you? I'm literally the only one on this floor, six four five. Home sweet home. The way I was crying, I'm the only one who is here. And look, I have two beds. I mean, two. What's that? Twin beds. And a big bed. <gasps> How amazing! I think I've got the biggest room. <laughs> I might have gotten the biggest room. The lighting is not great, though, guys. So, uh, let's see, where do we switch on? This is the bathroom. Uh, you know what, I don't know if I'm gonna do my makeup because this thing... Mm, it is so 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 but I'm gonna take out the headband in Tarsakha let's see my view this is my view how beautiful Oh, this is so beautiful. There's a fire over there. So pretty. Good morning, guys. Yo. <laughs> oh, my word. I couldn't It's all like my shit, and now when time lo young, no J, I shame why say it. I have this fever blister, and it is so so and so irritating. <sighs> Anyways, um, this is me this morning. I'm wearing my Domestos t shirt, and we are off to a high school around here um yeah is it a high school or primary school but we're going there today for training i'll take you guys with me and i'm trying to say it's cool mrs zulu pale and over it's calling less work with mrs zulias i'm a zulu la person that was all rabu 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 lela this salamu this morning so anyways guys oh my gosh <laughs> I feel so weird and so awkward. I want to show you guys what Domestos um, gifted us with. And I had already packed these things in my bag. Um, let me do this. So they gifted us this bottle of sparkling juice. And these popcorn. Some chocolate. Bolton. There's another packet of biltong in my bag and like two sticks in my bag and chocolate. So this was very nice. So I've just yeah, packed these things in my bag because obviously I don't know where I'm going to fit to this box. But I'm so proud of myself. I am done in time. I'm meeting at 6 a.m. and I'm done soon. I'll see you guys later. We're going to go to breakfast and then I'll see you guys later. She's somebody else 
in the making first She's just gotta stop all the faking And she She's wondering